Anna Capolini and Luca Lenote of Italy, eighth season together. They're the 2012 Italian champions, again in second place, but only by one one hundredth of a point. And in the short dance, they have the highest technical score of all of the teams. A little bit off in the synchronicity of that twizzle. Now we have to mention another overlapping detail. Not only are the top two teams skating to Carmen, but they sort of did a flip-flop in the coaching scheme of things as well, with Igor Spielbahn leaving the camp with Virtue and Moyer and Marina Zueva and taking on Capellini and Lenote as one of his new teams. So they've also been working in Michigan this year. And would it be safe to say that it's not a coincidence that we're hearing Carmen for both of these teams? It's really hard to say the timing <laughs> of all of this working out, but in all reality, we can't say that it was an original idea for anyone to skate to Carmen. Everyone skated to Carmen. We just have to see who does it better today. Oh, a little stumble there from Luca, putting his foot down in that twizzle. As much as I like these two as storytellers, and I think this is a good program idea for them, they're, they're tentative in their skating right now. And it's very difficult to hold back even an ounce when you're going up against the Olympic champions. They need to get more aggressive with this program as it develops, but I really do enjoy it. mentioned tentative you have to wonder being so close to the top team in the world does that make you be a little tentative <laughs> it can and, and I, I think under different circumstances later in the season they might feel more confident with themselves and be a little bit more aggressive regardless but again I think this is a really good program for them I think that last season they had a breakthrough I loved every performance of their last La Strada performance 
free dance last season. And I think this carries through that momentum and adds another layer to their skating with more strength, with more maturity, most importantly. And I think this is a fabulous program for them, whether Virtue and Moyer have it or not. I think this is a great vehicle. And that is a really strong score for the beginning of the season. Obviously, they have high expectations for themselves. You know, they said, not bad, not bad. So they have their eyes set on something even higher. But that's a fantastic start.